We are finally in June, so Flight has finally reached his full potential. And in today's video, we're going to be seeing if an entire team of Flight in June could go 82 and 0. Oh, so, so here we are with an entire team of Flight in June inside of NBA 2K20. And his stats are 99 everything, and he also has every single badge in the game. He has 75 total badges, and we're going to be seeing if this team can go 82-0 in today's NBA. I am in my league. We're just going to simulate through a season and find out if this will actually be possible. I definitely do think it will. 99 overall, flight in June. He's 1-0 already. I just don't think he's going to be stoppable. But let's just get right into the simulation. Okay, we made it to the All-Star Draft. For some reason, there's players on the team that are not just flight and also flight did not even become a captain but on the all-star teams we do have four of our 15 flights on the teams which is pretty impressive i would like to see them all make it but four is pretty good and so far flight is 50 and oh and these games have not even been close i mean everybody had their chance before june to try to beat him but now june in flight i mean he, he's just unstoppable no team is even going to be coming close this entire nba season Let's see if he can win the three-point or dunk contest so surprisingly there is no flight in the three-point contest maybe it's because there's four of him in the dunk contest and that is exactly what it was we got four flights in the dunk contest which makes sense he is one of the best dunkers in the league right now. And let's see what Flight can do in the dunk contest. See which Flight is going to come out on top. All right, here we are hopping into the dunk contest. Round number one, for some reason, he's wearing a Wizards jersey. Doesn't make a lot of sense. Not too bad for round one, but I definitely think he can do a little better. That's going to give him a 43. All right, second dunk coming up. And okay, definitely think the first dunk was a little better. 43 yet again so 243s for flight i mean we, we gotta see him get a 50 here let's see if he's gonna pull off a 50 dunk alley-oop to himself behind the head and then throws it down and that's gonna be the lowest score so far only a 41 one more flight to dunk in round number one gonna throw the self alley-oop that went super high and nothing crazy right there 43 though for for that final flight so 443 is 141 see if fight can get a perfect 50 in the second round again looking like it's going to be the self alley-oop and i think it's kind of similar to stuff we've already seen and that is going to be a 47 really really close to that perfect 50 again going for the self alley-oop loves the self alley-oop and that one's only a 37, the lowest score so far. Okay. It's going to come in at a 40. Uh, he's just not trying super hard dunks. Here we go. Looks like he's going to jump over Ben Simmons right here through the legs. And he gets it to go. I don't even know if that was Ben Simmons. No, nah, that definitely was not Ben Simmons, but... Nonetheless, that was the best dunk so far. Going to get another 47. Still can't get that perfect 50. We got one more round here, though. Come on, Flight. You got to get this perfect 50. There we go. Underneath both his legs. It's like that Aaron Gordon dunk, except he didn't hop over a mascot. And another 47 for Flight. All right. Another self alley-oop. And just a... Uh, East Bay right there through the legs. Nothing crazy. Uh, still got some of 40 though. I think this is our second last flight. Again, self alley oop. And uh, nothing crazy there. Uh, another 40. And our final flight up here. Come on. He's got to get a 50. 
2K is just not giving him hard enough dunks. I think he could make the 50s, and yeah, we already saw that one. So I'm guessing that's going to be pretty low. Only a 37. We were so close. We saw a few 47s. No 50s being pulled out. I definitely think he could have pulled off a 50 if 2K gave him the opportunity. But obviously, we got, we got Flight in June as our sl slam dunk contest winner. Coming over to the All-Star game, none of the flights really went off at all, so no, uh, so no All-Star MVP for Flight, but Flight still undefeated because he was on both teams, so he got a W either way, and he won the Slam Dunk Contest. So still no L's for Flight in this simulation so far. Let's see if he can continue this for the rest of the season. 57-0, I think he's going to be able to do it. 80 and oh now two more games he's got the grizzlies and the warriors let's see if he's going to be able to beat both them he defeats the grizzlies and he defeats the warriors so flight is able to go 82 and l and that does not happen much in nba 2k20 so really impressive by him he ends up winning rookie of the year he should have got mvp but there is 15 of him on one team so kind of hard to stand out Rookie of the Year for Flight, Six Man of the Year for Flight, Defensive Player of the Year for Flight. Doesn't get most improved, uh, but Flight's head coach is going to get Coach of the Year as well. So a really successful season here for Flight. He is in the Eastern Conference, which doesn't make a lot of sense because he's the Los Angeles Flight Crew. But uh, the East is a little bit easier. And I want to come over here and check out team stats just to see how he compared to the rest of the league points per game he scored 40 more points per game than any other team in the nba and he also allowed 14 less points than any other team giving him a differential of 65 and a half the next closest with the was the clippers at 8.7 so nobody even close to doing as good as he did field goal percentage is the best in the nba he made the most three pointers per game had the highest three-point percentage, had the highest free throw percentage, had the most rebounds per game, had the most assists per game, had the most steals per game, had the most blocks per game, and he had the most turnovers per game, which you don't really want, but, but he's got to be on top for everything. He also had the best bench in the NBA as well. Just checking out the top flights on the team three flights actually score 18 points per game and all the flights that did end up playing scored over 10 points per game but we're just gonna hop into the playoffs now and see if flight can go undefeated in the playoffs like he did in the regular season up against the brooklyn nets in the first round and that is an easy 4-0 sweep for flight in the second round he's gonna be facing off against the milwaukee bucks who have the first seed in the nba right now but flight making light work of them with another 4-0 sweep making the eastern conference finals gonna be facing off against the toronto raptors and yet again another sweep for flight react so so far flight in june undefeated in the regular season undefeated in the playoffs gonna be facing off against the clippers in the nba finals and let's see if he's able to go undefeated here get another sweep up to a 2-0 lead make that a 3-0 lead looking like flight is going to get yet another sweep and hopping into game four flight up by 60 points so it's going to be another sweep for him in the playoffs i'm pretty sure flight in jude is the only player able to go 82-0 in the regular season and undefeated in the playoffs inside of nba 2k20 Looks like he might be the best player in the game. Inside and a huge dunk for Flight. Usually the problem with a point guard or shooting guard trying to go 82-0 is that they get dominated by the centers, but that just did not happen in this simulation at all. Just nobody was able to stop Flight. Last time we had Flight on here as well, he actually wasn't even able to to beat a zero overall so the fact that he was able to go from losing to a zero overall to going 82 and 0 is pretty impressive there he is holding up that championship trophy and of course flight gonna get mvp finals mvp as well in the finals 
Finals MVP flight, 16.8 points per game, 8 rebounds, 6 and a half assists. Thought the stats would be a little higher. Of course, it's an entire team of him. But that is going to be it for this video. Our first player to go 82-0 and undefeated in the playoffs inside of NBA 2K20, I'm pretty sure. But if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. This is Peter Boy Speakwell. I'll see you next time. Peace. I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them. I run through the money, the press will be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage. I'm going through something. That's why I ain't calling. Phone in progression. It's all that I wanted. The phone in affection. I summon and double. Cause I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems. I solve them. I run through the money.